Good morning, everybody, and welcome back to the potting shed. One of our subscribers asked me, how on earth do you take cuttings off a blue myrtle cactus? And when I first started the channel three months ago, I did a short on the blue myrtle cactus with the Clint Eastwood music, the good, the bad and the ugly behind it. But I didn't show you how to do it. So what I'm doing today is I'm just having a look at those original cuttings that I took and checking if they've started to produce roots, which they have just at the base of the cutting. Now these, these cuttings were taken from the tip of the plant, um, but I've also done some cuttings from the centre of the stem and both are rooting and the ones from the centre of the stem are producing pups that you could break off and take cuttings from again or just root as the pups. Now really you wouldn't disturb these cuttings for 12 months but for Harry and this demonstration we are doing. Also you would um, take the cuttings in the spring or summer not in the autumn time we're just into September now and you do this in the spring and summer but because it's a bit of a demo I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do a cutting today. Now these central stem cuttings are producing loads of pups that can be broken off and repotted but again spring and summer. This is the mother plant that I took all the cuttings off and look at that pup on the top it's giant. This is where we're going to take our cutting from and I'm going to use a sharp sterilised knife just be careful and I can't do it and hold the camera so I'm going to come back when it's cut off and here we go it's cut off and you can see nice clean cut just the tip and we're going to leave this plant now and the cutting to heal over and we're going to leave it two weeks it's a bit like a scab if you cut yourself you it heals underneath so we need to leave this cutting for two weeks do this in the spring and summer like I say this is just as a demo today and uh, so I'm going to put this on the side and forget about it and just let it heal over once it's healed in two weeks you're going to pot it into some cacti mix some really free draining compost and forget about it okay thanks for watching if you've enjoyed the video please leave me a thumbs up and Harry I hope you enjoyed it